This is a podcast of Nathan, Nat and Sean. Let's go. Harry Fitzgerald, who normally we just let him press the buttons, but every Friday we give him the microphone and... Let You're feeling soar. it? Dream of this moment all week, oh, I know, guys. I all week. Time yeah. to be we get thirsty by this stage. We need yeah. a tall drink of water. Yeah, yeah. I'm right here. I'm right here. Hey, uh, <laughs> oh, you know what I enjoyed this week? When you guys started um, pointing the finger at um, people responsible for the Wildcats losing <laughs> all their games. Wait, we or, or Sean? Sean. Yeah, Sean, Sean mainly. Sean oh. also said something else um, <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> Oh, okay. right. See, he might not want to strap yourself This morning in. he didn't want something to be mentioned oh, yes. today. Oh, are but, you playing that? Well, look, I don't, I, as we say, I don't make the rules right. It doesn't here. matter. They've been yeah, gone. The rules, Harry. Oh, 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 I hope they're listening. All right, here we go. But listen. Nathan, Nat and Sean's <laughs> Weekly Debrief. Earlier this week, Shawnee Mack was over in Melbourne, the head of the Melbourne Cup. But it wasn't all fun and games when he found out about something very interesting. Our boss, he runs the Melbourne Nova as well, and he has allowed their breakfast show to have today off. The today day off. before Melbourne Cup. Yes. Dawn, I'm going to send you over an outfit where you're going to dress as a fern and you're going to stay there for a week. <laughs> Can do, Nathan. And Can their do. breakfast team's wrapping it up by the end of the yeah. year too. I mean, obviously, that's why they've just given up. Is that what's happening? Oh. Interesting. I'm happy to give up right now. Not a problem. Yeah. <laughs> now we know Sean doesn't mind a punt or three, so let's flash back to Tuesday to see which horses he put his money on. I'm kind of throwing in the um, one at odds there, um, Young Werther. Young Werther, 15th. Uh, Anyone else, Sean? Number six, straight off the bat as well there. Uh, number six, without a fight. Good horse. 13th, uh, improving. Do your mail. 12th. Uh, and ninth order. Is- oh, ninth order came ninth. Top 10. And only six spots away from anything worth celebrating. Oh, the money is gone. On Wednesday. Say the guys faced the biggest challenge of their radio careers. Their usual studio had broken down, so they had to do the entire show from Studio 2. Yeah, boo. This didn't seem to phase them too much, though. Studio 2 sucks and we have to broadcast out of it. Yep, and that wasn't the end of it. In fact, that was hardly even the start. I hate it. I hate it. We, this morning on the show, will be doing nothing but complaining about this (laughs) until it's fixed. (laughs) So that's your morning welcome. Settle in. (laughs) You'll be a bumpy ride. Every break. (laughs) Song, complain about the studio. (laughs) Song, complain about the studio. Mm. Despite Nathan's threats about the show contents, plenty of magic moments did come from Studio 2 on Wednesday, and one was when the guys caught up with comedian Judith Lucy. Things got pretty heated. You went to the same school that our good friend Sean McManus's daughter is currently going to now. Not Santa Maria Ladies College. So you went to a ladies' college. That's interesting, isn't it? <laughs> and good morning, Nathan. <laughs> did you go to a <laughs> college? Another highlight from Studio 2? Well, Oh, that was when the guys discovered a giant screen which showed live CCTV footage of the whole building. It got pretty gross. Yes. We just saw Amy go to the toilet yep. to do a poo. <laughs> <laughs> so that was exciting. Oh, oh Amy's back from doing it. That was a oh, big she one. she was in there a long time. That was, a, that was yeah. she must have had a lot to, lot to eat last or she, night. Or she had to go and have a good cry. <laughs> which is only it's like lovely. Is cry. <laughs> do you reckon she cries and has a poo? <laughs> Same time? <laughs> I mean, it's you getting know, it all out, you know, Nathan. Two birds. <laughs> Hi, my name is Amy. Hi, Amy. I poo and cry at the same time. Well, thanks, Amy. That must have taken a lot of guts to share that. This morning, the OG sibling boy band dropped by the studio. Hanson! And like the professional he is, Shawnee Mac wanted to know exactly who was who before the interview started. Which is the one that Isaac, who was a bit goofy looking when he was a bit older, playing yeah, the right town short. Why don't you say it's his face, Sean? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, Sean? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mate, we all thought about it. Sean. We all thought about it. Oh, my God. Sean McManus. You wanted to spring me again this morning. I was so wanting to spring you again. By playing that too, Isaac. But then I Goofy thought, face. you'll run to the toilet and you'll poo and cry. <laughs> <laughs> Amy. Amy, what a, what a career. Amy, come up to my face. What a career highlight for you. You've worked in radio for how long? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, it's more than 15, eight, 20, 15 years. 20 years. Yeah. I, I, and this yeah. is what you're reduced to. <laughs> how much convincing did it take for you to get into the recording booth and say those lines? Harry, how much? None at all. Oh, <laughs> none at all. Straight you know away. Because the truth great. is easy to tell. <laughs> <laughs> great. great work, Harry. Well done. Oh. Another banger. <laughs> 
Nathan, Nat and Sean is a Nova podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcasts.com.au.